This is what an average day looks like on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this dude mining with his earth bending. He's using the dig and earth tunnel abilities to reveal ores and then mining them with his pickaxe. He just found some diamonds. Like, this literally looks straight out of one of my videos, which might be because I promote my server with real gameplay. I found these two dudes trying to combine their water bending and their metal bending. This guy is using the surge ability to levitate this ice platform, and the other guy is trying to grapple on top of that with his metal bending. And once he gets on top, he starts using it as a platform to build on. Excellent teamwork. And this player was nice enough to immortalize me with this giant statue he built. Needless to say, I'm speechless. Like and subscribe if you want to see more of these videos, and if you want to be a part of one of them, make sure you join my server. Here's what another average day looks like on my Four Elements Minecraft server. I found this player mining with his earthbending abilities, which I thought was pretty cool until he made it painfully obvious that he was using an x-ray pack. Hot in 4K, bro. Next, I teleported right in the middle of a 1v1 between an airbender and a firebender. All right, guys, I wonder who's gonna win. My money's on the firebender, but it looks like the airbender is gonna take the dub. GG. Found this guy wearing a Donald skin, so he must be a fan of the President's Play videos. Then he started using his firebending to incinerate polar bears. Oh, it looks like we've got some interesting new real estate popping up on the server as well. Like Johnny here, for example, who decided that he wants to live in a geode. This dude was trying to figure out his water bending abilities for the first time and then he found a swamp where he started taking advantage of his plants bending abilities. Swamps are great for water benders because they get super easy access to both water and important materials. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see more people watching. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. I found these two players building a bridge. One of them kept using their water bending abilities to make whirlpools to troll the other pretty funny. Later I came back and I realized they weren't actually building a bridge, but an underwater highway for waterbenders. That's actually really cool. Later I saw this guy mining with his earthbending abilities, and then he found some diamonds. Good for him. I came across this little building, and it turns out somebody was generous enough to build a bending school where new players can go to learn their abilities. That's actually pretty wholesome. Aww. This player thought that using his fire bending skills would help him cut down trees faster. Obviously it didn't work, but I like how he just pulverizes the tree out of existence and then it's all like, hey, where's my wood? Subscribe for more people watching content. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. I found this friend group trying out their bendings for the first time. One of them chose fire bending, and as you can see, he's testing out some combustion abilities. Looks like the other guy is practicing his water bending techniques. Oh, and there's also the third dude who apparently hates dogs. I found this guy who accidentally started suffocating himself with his earth bending, so I decided to do some angel work and teleported him back up to the surface. You're welcome. Next, I found what I thought was going to be an epic 1v1 between a fire and airbender, but then the airbender started pulling out some bending techniques which I must have never seen before. Let's just say we had a productive talk about it in my office. Later I found this gamer grinding some levels with his XP farm. Pretty basic spawner setup, very cool. Then I stumbled upon these guys mining some sandstone, and it turns out they're building a gigantic Egyptian pyramid somewhere in the desert. Subscribe for more people watching content. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. I found this guy mining in a cave and watch how he uses his airbending abilities to mine the ores he couldn't reach. Free scaffolding sure comes in clutch. Next, I found this dude building his house right next to a giant cemetery. Now, this place is pretty eerie. I don't know who built it or why it's here, and that sort of freaks me out a bit. Later, I found these two players testing their bending abilities out, and as you can see, the airbender seems to be a pretty quick learner. The waterbender struggles a bit, but eventually he gets the hang of it. Nice job. I found these two parties exchanging the internationally recognized sign of peace. Hopefully, this is the start to a beautiful new friendship. This chick is building her house on the side of a mountain. Very cool. These guys have the largest automatic melon and pumpkin farm I think I have ever seen on Bender's MC. I guess you could say they're entrepreneurs of sorts. Subscribe for more people watching content. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this player testing out their water bending abilities at night. If you didn't know, water bending abilities appear larger and deal more damage during the nighttime. Look, he even built himself a temporary ice shelter. Next, I found this guy beating up animals for no reason, so I disguised myself as a pig and started beating him up. This being the most ethical solution to the problem. Next, I found somebody mining with his earth bending. Will they find any diamonds? And it looks like they will. This guy is working on a carrot and potato farm he made somewhere in the slums. And speaking of farms, last time I showed off the largest melon and pumpkin farm I've ever seen on Bender's MC. But this player took that as a challenge and built an even larger one right next door. 
damn, that's cold. And finally, I found this player earth surfing into the sunset. Subscribe for more people watching content. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found these two players sparring with their water and their airbending in front of a gorgeous lakeside property they built. Very nice. Next, I noticed that the guy who built the bending school we checked out not too long ago got fed up with people building their houses nearby and decided to completely remake the bending school somewhere else. I gotta say, I like the new setup a lot, and it's bigger so more people can learn how to bend at the same time. Next, I discovered a player who made their own custom banner shop, and it looks like he's selling them for $5,000 a pop. As you can see, they look pretty dope. What a creative business idea. It looks like somebody got inspired by my videos and built their own shrieker pit to torture players. Very nice. And these guys built their own arena that they can use to practice their bending in, duel other players, and even host tournaments. Subscribe for more people watching content. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this player using his water bending abilities as scaffolding to help him build. Definitely a 1000 IQ move. Next, I found this new player incinerating a horse with his fire bending. So I decided to disguise myself as a horse and beat the shit out of him. Don't worry, I hooked him up with some sweet loot afterwards. Later, I found this guy who's obviously a subscriber, Chad, because he used his fire bending to perform the rocket jump technique I demonstrated in a recent video. I found these two water benders swimming in formation, and it looks like one of them doesn't know how to turn off their water arms. Just press five and double click, bro. This player was working on his brand new sky base when suddenly disaster struck. Caleb figured out that if you use your lightning abilities on a water source, it will conduct and become electrified. And this player was working on a cherry blossom tree at his base. Bro, just wait for 1.20. Subscribe for more people watching content. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this guy who built an earth bendable door for this very cool looking castle he's working on. Next, I found this chick with her horse, so I decided to be generous and give it a fun new nickname. Rocky is finishing up his most ambitious project yet, the Inferno Casino. That's an awesome name. It's got a pretty dope looking interior with a bunch of different games you can play. Gotta respect the hustle, it's creative. Sometimes I forget just how awesome water bending is. This guy was traveling in his boat, so I decided to hitch a ride in it, and bro literally took me on a voyage. These guys are building the world's deadliest bending arena. The flames around the court not only add aesthetic, but it makes the gameplay more intense. Remember, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Make sure to subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found a player working on his Japanese styled house looking good, man. Next, I found this one player fighting some pillagers, but I didn't realize how outnumbered he was. Like, this guy's screwed. No way he can take on 25 pillagers at once. But Earthbending says otherwise, he ended up taking out the entire horde with only his bending abilities. Now that's skill. I discovered this player working on his farm, and apparently he's neighbors with the fucking Aztecs. Okay, so I found this player mining straight down. Like, isn't that what you're not supposed to do in Minecraft? But his friend hopped down there with him, and I realized they were actually staggering cobblestones and using their airbending abilities to use it as a makeshift elevator. Now that's a 1000 IQ play. And this guy was practicing the age old Bender's MC get rich quick scheme, mining and selling granite. Remember, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Make sure to subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. It's nighttime and it's raining, which means everybody is switching to water bending to take advantage of those damage buffs while they can. Next, I found this dude working on their roller coaster, so I decided to take a ride in it. I'm telling you, the second I left, he did decided to turn on his fly hacks. It looks like this young lad is getting ready to reform the British Empire. Mm, isn't that right, chaps? Next, I found this player x-raying. But Blitz, how do you know he's x-raying? Well, first, I can tell that he's purposely going after copper and gold ore, which sells for a bunch here. And he's leaving behind this super irregular mining pattern. Caught in 4K, bro. This guy was not x-raying. In fact, he was mining with his earthbending abilities and even found some diamonds. This guy's a certified subscriber, Chad, because he's recreating the earthbending base we made in our recent YouTube video. Very nice. Remember guys, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Remember to like and subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this plant bender in their natural habitat. You know, just swinging on vines because that's what plant benders do. Some people play benders MC normally, but these guys were like, fuck it, we're playing Skyblock. I found this guy playing the server just as we intended. Good old earth bending mining. And he found some ancient debris. Nice job. You know, they're always saying men don't stress, but are you sure about that? To the new players who started this underground base, just dig a little farther down and you'll find this mineshaft filled with loot. Thank me later. These guys are working on their airbending sanctuary, and to protect themselves, they built this massive wall. <laughs> just wait until they find out that firebenders can fly. I wanted to record this guy people watching, but he was like, 
No. Subscribe for more people watching content. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. This plant bender dude tried to run away from a fight, but got one tapped by some lightning bending. Another person playing Bender's MC exactly as we intended. Scaffolding with his air bending gets the job done quick. This guy built an Enderman farm. Very nice. Wait, what does this say? This waterbender was annoying this earthbender, so bro literally departed. Hi, Kevin. This player is building up an empire. He's got a big members list and not one, but two castles he's building. When I said I could speak sign language on my resume, this is really what I meant. Somebody was nice enough to build a bending school in the second survival world for new players to enjoy. Way to serve the community, bro. Remember guys, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Make sure to like and subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this player using his water bending abilities to make obsidian bridges for him and his friends to get across the lava in the nether. Next, I found this guy using his air bending to build this dope looking castle. So this guy asked me to be on people watching while I was secretly people watching, so I threw eggs at him. He sensed my presence. Epic water bending snipe in three, two, one. Okay, this dude is not getting past airport security. These players waterlogged the floor of their base so that they could use their water bending abilities wherever they want. This chick is building some public infrastructure. Love to see that tax money going to work. Remember, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Don't forget to subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. This is why you should never lightning bend a creeper on Bender's MC. And unfortunately, this dude found out the hard way. This player was herding some goats back to his base, so I decided to disguise myself as one and start following him. He who controls the goats controls the world. This dude was fighting some underwater enemies, so he activated his water bubble ability, which allowed his airbending friend to come and help him. Great work. These guys worship a tyrant. Very nice. This guy decided to build his base on the water, which is pretty cool. Oh, and it's just right outside the biggest Minecraft cave I think I've ever seen. This guy right here built his very own earthbending academy. Damn, this place is nice. When does class start? I was checking out this dude's XP farm when I found yet another reminder that some of you need serious help. Remember, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Make sure to subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. This player used his earth bending to burrow underground when he found some diamonds. To avoid being crushed by the respawning blocks, he used his mining ability to make an air pocket and collect the diamonds. These guys are building an underground base using that new pink wood. It's pretty dope. Well, it looks like they put their beds five feet apart because they're just homies. The first thing this guy did when he figured out how to water bend was pick up a squid with his blood bending, throw it on the beach, and then spam it to death with abilities. Average Bender's MC player. Man, I wish I could have a dope username like Tess Tickles. I feel like I'm watching one of those scammers get scammed videos. Okay, wait, he's given her an enchanted book. What's she gonna trade in return? Oh, she's gone. Remember guys, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Make sure to subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I stumbled upon a 1v1 between a water and a firebender. The firebender activated his fire wall, which the waterbender just swam under. The waterbender tried to strike back with water arms, but ended up grabbing a squid by accident, which he just used as a meat shield. The firebender got a lucky shot and took him down. Bro lost on his own turf. Mr. Bob the boss found out that trapdoors can be used to evade our AFK kicker so he could grind out his creeper farm. Sorry, no hard feelings, Bob. According to this guy, forced labor looks best in pink. Alright, let's check on the chicken man. Oh, he's cooking chicken with his firebending. What a surprise. Dude, what the hell are these menu options? Oh, nice, he just filled out this dude's order. What? Wow, this guy sure is good at finding diamonds. <laughs> Wait, actually, he's a little too good. Nobody likes X-rayers, so I decided to give him a scare and then add him to my cringe compilation. Smile! Remember, guys, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I saw this super stacked firebender ambush a brand new earthbender. But in the spirit of David versus Goliath, he was quick to activate his lava bending and took down a much more powerful opponent. This player right here is fascinated by the transparent nether portal plugin we use on the server. You can seamlessly walk in and out like it's an actual part of the world. This guy was using his airbending to build this giant shulker box when I noticed he built it right next to a giant bookcase, which is right next to a giant armor stand. Probably one of the most aesthetically pleasing shopping centers on Bender's MC. This guy is grinding. He's using his earthbending abilities to x-ray for diamonds twice as fast. X-raying can get pretty lonely though, so I was nice enough to spawn in some friends to mine with him. This guy is not x-raying, but instead carving out his brand new secret underwater base. Best of luck with that, my friend. Remember guys, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main 
main characters. Subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this dude bloodbending his friend. He attempted to feed him to the undead, but this guy put up a fight and freed himself. He retaliated with lava bending, but missed his attack. The waterbender then got a super lucky kill shot, which I just managed to get on screen. I don't think I've ever seen XP farming go so wrong so fast. Like, what did this guy even do to deserve this? Like, goddamn. This chick is working on her axolotl tank that she just built in this pink hobbit hole looking place. Pretty cool. Wait until this dude figures out that you can just use your water bending to fish 10 times faster. This guy is going to be swimming in bender money after he sells all that granite. So what do we think this guy's building? It's symmetric, color coded, but also uses a bunch of redstone. I honestly have no idea, but leave your guesses down below. Remember guys, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this player using his water bubble ability to create an air pocket to collect clay. Not only does this make finding clay easier, but it allows the player to mine it faster. These guys are trying to collect every armor trim combination in the game. It's coming along pretty well, and the display even has two stories. I caught this noob walking around this ancient city like he owns the place. But bro thinks he's the warden. Oh, he's uh, using his earthbending abilities to get away. I think he heard a spooky noise. This guy just finished his very own private waterbending arena, which is located in the basement of his underwater base. These two guys just finished their cherry blossom themed shop. I think it looked pretty cool. So I was doing a meetup on one of the survival worlds when I saw this guy using his airbending abilities to make his boat fly. I chased him down and he even let me go for a ride. I think this might be the future of commercial travel on Bender's MC. Remember guys, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Subscribe and join my server. Here's some more people watching on my Four Elements Minecraft server. First, I found this waterbender who was trying to do some underwater caving but ended up drowning himself. Lucky for him, his guardian angel was watching and I TP'd him back to where he died with a boat. Remember, everybody gets one. Next, I found this plant bender checking out their abilities for the very first time. Looks like he's having fun. This guy is doing some x-raying really close to this pool of lava. Man, it'd be a shame if something were to happen. God damn it. Can go down. I found this firebender trying to befriend a noob, but he was wearing frostwalker boots, which really confused me because it made him look like he was also a waterbender. My man Seb just discovered the magic of airbending. Look, he even made his first tornado. Ah, they grow up so fast. Hunting with your firebending on my server is as effective as it is hilarious. Remember guys, the best part about people watching is that you guys are the main characters. Subscribe and join my server.